trip in need. Welcome to the channel. Hope everybody just having a wonderful day and that your day is going great as mine and that you are in the best of health. And health is key. Health is important. So I'm coming with another retirement video and this video is entitled, You Hold the Keys to Your Own Future. You hold the keys to your own future. As we look at the whole world and we see that things have changed drastically, there's still hope. But you gotta find your place in life and still you can end up at a good place. But when you give up hope and you lose hope, you are in trouble. So this video is entitled, You Hold the Keys to Your Own Future. Now, I want to use my life as an example. A young man trying to figure out my way, being brought up in the hood, going through a lot of stuff, parents got divorced, ended up living with my older sister, I turned into a runaway, a whole nine yards, okay? It was just bad, bad, bad coming up, okay? But I began at that point when I got to high school, and I went to three different high schools, from foster home to another foster home, but I ended up going to Central High School in Newark, New Jersey. Some of you may know what I'm talking about. If you're from Jersey and you're watching this channel. Um, I graduated from Central, and I thought going into the military would be a good start, because if I stayed here in the streets, I'm gonna end up in trouble, a bum, or either dead in the graveyard looking up pushing up daisies. I went to the military and I, I took the furthest and the furthest, well, I wouldn't say furthest country, but I took the furthest uh, place away from New Jersey, which was Europe, Germany. And that's a nice, nice long ride across the Atlantic Ocean. Seven to eight hour trip. That's a long way from home. That military experience for me was a start and was an opening door to a lot of other things that found me in the Caribbean today. But I had to get up and do something. I never expect nobody to do nothing for me. What I'm trying to tell you is that a lot of people make excuses for them not being successful. And that's what this retirement perspective video is all about. You can do what you want to do, and you can be what you want to be if you just open up your ears and listen and begin to do some research and find out what, what some people have done to be successful. It's up to the individual to set their own course and what their life's going to be about. Because it's how you begin will determine how you end. So, you hold the keys to your own destiny and future. And don't blame it all on God, don't blame it all on your nephew, your uncle, your cousin. It is you. What I tell you is, you got to at least stop at the first door to get to the second door. You can't sit back. 30, 40, 50 years old and saying coulda, shoulda, woulda and expect the, the government to pay you and give you what they really don't have. And if you're not successful and you sit back watching everybody else leave you behind in the passing lane, don't get jealous and don't hate them. Just blame yourself. Remember, from this retirement video. If you ever want to see a retirement, stocks, or anything in life, you got to start from somewhere. I started with the military, and here I am right now. And I'm so glad that I made that decision, but only God knows where I'd be at right now. You hold the keys to your own destiny. And it's what you do coming out of the blocks running like a sprinter will determine how you're going to end up. I discovered that some things about life is life is not a sprint, but it's a marathon. And it is how you start will determine 
how you finish. Remember, very powerful words. Parents tell your kids this while they're still young, 12, 13, 14, 15. They hold the keys to their own destiny. So I hope you got some of these messages. If not, look around you. And we'll see where you're, where you're gonna be at. You hold the keys to your own future. So, in the meantime, between the time, always remember that life is to be enjoyed. Hit that description, notification, thumbs up. And we'll see you on the next video.